Hello everyone, it's time to review and check part 1 and 2. Well, before we start, make sure to like and subscribe. Let's review. Part 1. Grammar. Everybody circle A or B. For example, look. What's your name? B. Right? Stop the video. Take your time. Do it yourself. All right. Very good. And do it with your partner again. Yeah. Check your answers. Learn from each other. Very good. Now my turn. Number one. Are you from Peru? Number two. I'm not Lisa. I'm Marisa. Number three. Hi, Mark. You're in my class. Well done. Number four. Where are you from? I'm from Saudi Arabia. Very good. Number five. Where's Toronto? It's in Canada. Number six. Is John married? No, he isn't. Number seven. Is she English? Is she from England? No, she's American. Number eight. They aren't Spanish. They're Mexican. Number nine. Are you on vacation? No, we're here on business. Number ten. Anna and Julia are from Recife. Or Recife. I'm not good with names. They're Brazilian. Number 11. Are Abe and Keiko Japanese? Yes, they're from Tokyo. Number 12. How old are you? I'm 19. Number 13. How are you? Fine, thanks. And you? Number 14. What's your address? It's 304 Main Street. And number 15. How do you spell your last name? G-A-R-C-I-A. -A. You did great. Vocabulary. The words. Let's do it together. Me and you. Complete the chart. Country, nationality. China, Chinese. Turkey or Turkey, the new name. Turkish. Okay, nationality is Saudi. So the country is Saudi Arabia. The United States, American. English, England. Brazilian, Brazil. Japan, the country, Japanese is the nationality. Okay? Write the next word or number. Let's see. One, two, three. Zero, one, two, five, six. 7, 11, 12, 13, 19, 20, 21. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. That was easy, wasn't it? One more. Complete the words. Where are you from? Good morning. What do you say? Open your books, please. Page 19. Sorry, I'm late. Okay, sit down. What's the answer to number 10? I don't know. Excuse me. What's Plato in English? Plate. Can you repeat that, please? Yes, plate. What's your phone number? 555-8942. Thanks. What's your email? It's Tom at hotmail.com. And that's it. Let's write these objects. For example, a dictionary. What is number one? A chair. Number two, the door. Number three, a pen. And number four, the board or the whiteboard. Very easy. Pronunciation. Everybody? Write the words for the sound pictures. For example, bike. What is this one? Number one, E, tree. Okay, phone, O, E, fish, she, shower, he, house. Very good. 
Now the stressed syllable. For example, look Saturday, Saturday, Chinese, Chinese. Repeat after me. 50, 50, 15, 15. Tomorrow, tomorrow, Argentinian, Argentinian. Very good. So far, so good. Everybody, read the profiles. We have Mark Davis, Bianca Costa, and Roger Ford. And fill in the blanks. For example, first name, Mark, last name, age. How old is he? How old is she? Nationality, where is he from? Where is she from? Marital status, for example, is he or she single or married? And occupation, occupation, job. What does he do? What does she do? Take your time, read, and fill in the blanks. And one more thing, write the information about you. A few moments later. Very good, you're back. Let's read it together. I'm Mark Davis. I'm from Seattle in the US. I'm a teacher. I'm 28 and I'm single. Nice. So, Mark, the last name is Davis. He's 28 years old. He's American. He's single and he is a teacher. Okay. I'm Bianca Costa. I'm from Rio in Brazil. I'm 20. I'm single and I'm a student. So, Bianca. The last name is Costa, she's 20 years old, she's from Brazil, so she's Brazilian, she's single, and she's a student. And Roger? I'm Roger Ford, I'm 40, I'm from Vancouver in Canada. I'm married with two children, I'm a doctor. Nice one. So Roger, the last name is Ford, he's 40 years old, he's Canadian, he's married, and he's a doctor. Now, what did you write about yourself? Okay, what's your first name? What's your last name? How old are you? Where are you from? Are you single? Are you married? And what do you do? What's your job? Speak with your friend. Compare your answers. Your turn. My friends, watch the video and choose A, B, or C. Your turn. Let's do it. What's your name? How do you spell it? What's your name? Jaina. How do you spell it? J-A-Y-N-A. -A. Where are you from? Where is California? Where are you from? I'm from California. Where in California? Sacramento, but I also lived in LA. How old are you? How old are you? I'm 66. Hmm. What's your cell phone number? What's your cell phone number? My phone number is 347-222-1289. What's your email address? What's your email address? My email address is cyoonit123 at yahoo.com. Very good. Everybody, check your answers with your friends. So, number one, all right, J A Y N A. Number two, California. Number three, Richard is 66 years old. Write his phone number is. 347-222-1289 and Christopher's email address is cyoonit123 at yahoo or yahoo.com You did great. Well done. Let's check your progress. Okay, can you say your name and where you are from? Okay, yes I can. You can do it. For example, I'm, I'm Surush and I'm from, for example, America. Turkey, Iran, right? Can you ask where other people are from? For example, where is he from? Where is she from? Of course you can do it. Can you spell your name? Well, I can. My first name is 
Surush, S-O-R-O-O-S-H. My last name is Jafari, J-A-F-A-R-Y. Very good. Can you count from zero to 100? Of course. Can you ask and give personal information? What's your name? What's your address? What's your uh, phone number? How old are you? Of course. Can you say your phone number? Yeah. Can you use and understand classroom language? Of course. You're my student. You're smart. You can do it. And can you use and understand classroom language? We did it. Can you check into a hotel? Yes. You go in and you say, I have a reservation. My name is this, this. And they check your name and they give you your room. And can you book a table at a restaurant? Of course, the same thing. You call, uh, for example, you say, a table for two. Yes, on Monday at seven o'clock. Yeah, you can do it. You're smart. If you can't do these, go back to the previous episodes and practice again. And this is the review for today. Stay committed, everybody. Practice on a daily basis. I've got your back. If you have a question, you can leave a comment down below and I will answer. And make sure to like and subscribe. Everybody, you can also become a member of the channel and support us. That's it for today. I'm out.